all the way till the time has turned today. Okay, what do we have going on today? Dear neighbor, I hope you are feeling settled in your new home. I'm writing to let you know that we have fertilizers, so why don't you buy some? Oh, cares. I don't know about that guy. He's questionable sometimes. Ba -da 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 -da. I'm not picking this up, I'm not picking this up. I'm not pulling the toy. Hello? Give me the Solomon bag. Saruman? Saruman the silly. What? Saruman the stupid. Stop that. Saruman the, the weakling. I said stop. Saruman the stinky. No! That's a, such a silly name. Cutting back the foliage, making sure things don't go crazy. -da. -da. I don't know if we can get down there right now. I don't think we can. We need to upgrade our stuffs. And to do that we need we need it to rain. But also. I need to go to the mines and stuff. We don't need it to rain, we just need it to rain for our crops. Um, I'm sure if I walk down and we go down and wander around in the bottom left, we'll find a dandelion. So, I mean, in fact, we probably passed one a, a while ago down there and we just didn't pick it up because we didn't have anything for it. What are the odds of that? Fairhaven Farm? It looks so pleasant. Howdy, neighbor. Ah, it's the new farmer. How are you doing on this fine, sunny day? I'm doing great, Andy. You caught me in the middle of tending my crops. I'm spreading some new Joja for fertilizer in my crop field. I always use Joja. It makes my crops stronger and healthier. Does it? Say, you're just starting out on sketching farm. I have something for you to help out with. Here's some fertilizer. I don't know. I have some strawberry seeds. Fairhaven Farm strawberries have a good reputation in Grampleton and Chestervale. Nice. I'll be sending them your way once I have the time. These here crops got me occupied. Aye, aye, Captain. You have yourself a nice day, Jacob. Go get some dirt on you. Aye, aye, Captain. We're picking dandelions. Don't ask why. It's for the forest spirits. Man, if I told anyone what I was doing right now, they would question my sanity. You're helping the forest spirits? Yep, they're gonna fix the place. They're gonna fix the place. Yep, they're gonna fix the place. And and you're offer you're giving them offerings of stuff. Yep. And they're gonna fix the place. They're fixing the place. They're gonna do it. Just you wait. Who set you who set you on this route? Did you come up with this on yourself? The wizard told me. Of course the wizard told you. But we saw them. What do you mean we, you saw them? We saw the little guys, the little forest spirits. We both did. did. Did you guys, like, did you guys do drugs? No, I mean, maybe, but not before we saw the things. That was a really weird way to answer that question. What do you mean? Oh, boy. Are you a cop? You have to tell me if you're a cop. Just kidding. Nobody has to tell me anything. It's a fire pit. Look at that cauliflower. That cauliflower is amazing. Indeed, it is huge. It's magic. I love that the wizard, in this mod, the wizard is also a farmer. He's farming some magic stuff. It's very silly. What was, I think it is cauliflower that can be that big in, in the base game. Like you can get that. You can get that with pumpkin and you can get that with cauliflower, I think. And if you break them, they just kind of turn into, they turn into a bunch of small ones that flood your inventory. Not really flood, but you know. We're in a forest. If 
found some leeks. I don't know if I've ever had a leek. They look like they could be my type of food. I like celery. Are leeks bitter? Sweet? Sour? Tangy? Tangy is another, that's another, another sense of taste. I didn't mean to do that. Da, da, da. Just wait until we have our own seed maker. We're gonna have the most crops in town. Although I believe there's no guarantee that, uh, wait, did one of the swords go missing? Gunther! Ah, we need to go. Oh my goodness, I wish I had the transportation. We need a dandelion, though. Those aren't dandelions, those are daffodils. They don't really look like daffodils, do they? Do they? I don't know. Bum, bum, ba -dum, ba -dum. Somebody just left the sword out here. You always assume leeks were like green onion? I have no idea. I like onions a lot, actually. I don't think I could eat a whole... It's like it was waiting for me. What's the catch? Where's the boulder that's gonna come and get me? What's the what, the fact that I don't have inventory? Is that, what, that's, is that the catch? I can just eat a horseradish or uh, sacrifice this one piece of wood that we have for some reason. Just, it was just sitting there, menacingly. I could eat a chunk of onion without too much. If it's cooked, I could eat a lot of onion. I love onion rings. They're really good. Why are there so many broken swords? What do we have? Rusty sword level one? What are these? Ah, that's my favorite. Inventory, inventory goal is my favorite thing. I hope I didn't throw that away. Why did we pick it back up? I threw it out so that we would pick something else. Forest sword. It's better in basically every way. I highly doubt we're getting money for that, so let's we'll just go with that. Is this sword good? What is this? Ancient sword. It's an artifact. Okay. Ah, crap. Well, now I have a dilemma. Celestine, some early life forms had bones made of this. That's interesting. Did we already, did we already give mushroom? I don't remember. What are the odds that it's expensive? I mean, we'll just eat the horse or add it. No, we'll get rid of the fire. It's fine. Okay, let's go. We are, we probably, I mean, we might make it to Gunther. What are the odds? Will we make it to, to Gunther? Are we fast enough? Not in this. This is going to slow us down like all heck. I forgot that grass does this. It's kind of annoying. I mean, I get it. I used to, my, my parents own land. And it used to have a ton of wild, just crap everywhere. Um, and it wasn't nearly as pretty as this, um, but it was a pain in the butt to wade through, like, to get out into it before my dad got, like, a mower and mowed it all down. But even then, I think we had to do some special stuff to make sure that the area was didn't have rocks and crap like that. Yeah. Okay, we just have to keep going. The lack of music. Solomon Bear, don't think about the berries right now. You've got more things to do than that. You can come back some other time. Horseradish. That's easy. Horseradish, you just pick up and go. And it was on. It was in my way. It's fine. I moved it into my inventory. I moved it into my inventory. Da, 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 da. 
need to get to Gunther, quick. Oh, you I haven't talked to. Or recently, Kia. What's up? I haven't talked to you much. I did. I missed you at the bunny festival. I think. Hey, Kia and I are both bored. What's that? Can you play on? Can we play on your farm? I don't know if it's safe to. Uh, hi. Excuse me. Promise we'll be good. Please, free please. I mean, I'd say yes, but you, I'm worried about you. Can we play on your farm? Can't mess up. You mess with the crops, you're out. Do you like birds, Farmer Jiko? Because if you don't, then we can't be friends. Oh, Elise, you're so sweet, Elise. Elise. I'm tutoring the kids today. They're a handful, but it's nice to make a difference in someone's life. Uh, Mom won't let me have any more gummies today. Uh, what is a life without gummies? Hi. Jess is cute. Uh huh. Oi, Gunther, I got some stuff you might like. Here. We've got this beautiful orb. And we have this other pretty orb. And we got a sword, too. Would you believe it? Melon seeds. Plant these in the summer. You can get a giant melon. That might have been what I was thinking of. How do I rearrange, do I rearrange this stuff? There's a way to do it, isn't there? Is it here? Orb has to go... Okay, are you serious? Really? Really? I'm gonna say, I don't think they thought this through very well. You really didn't... You didn't think this plan through very well? Excuse me. I can't... I can't believe you can't swap items in. Orb has to be in the center, right? And you can't look out. Oh my goodness, that's annoying. It's making an arrow. Oh well. Ah, uh, the fisherman. Not interested. I am a fisherman. I know fish. I don't really know fish all that well. I know a little fish. Perch. This is the first the and only fish that really comes to my mind. I know there's plenty others. Bass? Or, as some people call it, base. That was a really bad joke, just so everyone's aware. I know, I understand. What I know what I said. I know, I know what I said. You know what you did. Ba -da. What the? Is that the founder of our town? Hold the phone. Did we find... THE Mr. Pelican Memorial? The memorial for THE Mr. Pelican? What is it gonna say? That's the hero. Pelican Town. Date. 41719XX. Built in recognition of Stardew Valley's elegance. Okay, so my headcanon is that uh, there was a pelican, and he was really chill, and uh... He helped, he helped the town. Like, some people were trying to boss the town around, and then the, he just attacked them, and they were like, oh, you've got pelicans on your side? No thanks. And they, they backed out. Um, even better yet, he died in battle, fighting fiercely for the town. So they named the town after him, Pelican Town, and uh, buried him here. This is his memorial. Head cannons with Jacob. Thumbs up. Do, 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 do. Marvelous weather, don't you think? A fabulous day for reading in the garden, sheltered by the wonderful scent of rose and lavender. She's so sweet and cute, but also didn't she have an attitude earlier? I don't remember. You're pretty as well. It's very important doing our best to stay healthy. Thankfully, it's easy to eat fresh and organic with all the wonderful crops grown around this valley. You should come have some lunch with us one of these days. I should. Today I picked... I, I can't read. T today I can't read. Um, pelicans are boss. They are, though. Except when they're not. Uh, today I must check the lifeboat for leaks. It pays to be prepared for anything. I mean, that's true. 
that's, that's, that's fair. That's I mean that's that's super important. I was gonna say my favorite one of my favorite pit meme pictures is the um, the pelican that's trying to eat a capybara and the capybara does not give a flying brick that this pelican is trying to eat it and the pelican does not understand that it cannot fit the rest of the the capybara into his mouth. That's like one of the few times where I'm like, I think the capybara won. Like, what are you going to do? I could really go for a fried fish a la ridge right about now. Oh, yeah? Nice. I didn't go to this stupid place because I'm dumb. I did a mistake again. I went right past it. That's my state bird. They will try to eat anything. Linus? Not Linus. Yes, Linus? No, Linus is a different person. No, that is Linus. Sounds like those raccoons are back at it again, filthy varmints. They're actually pretty clean, George. Did you know they wash their hands and their food before they eat it? Ah, you turned up at the right time. Son, could you do an old man a favor? Could you go in and around the corner and scare off those raccoons for me? They've been causing a real mess. Thanks. Make sure you give them a good scare so they never come back. Boo! Da -na -na -na. Sorry. Da -da -da -da. I find a lot of hot, fresh food in these cans. Stuff that will go to waste if I don't take it. Do you think there's something wrong with what I'm doing? Uh, yes, it's, it's, it's... If I could get into the details of why it's disgusting? It's, it's not... No, it's not a matter of, of life, Linus, and his name is Linus. Um, the level... The amount of... You're gonna... You're gonna you're gonna get yourself real sick one of these days, and then you'll understand. Just because it's hot, like the germ spread, like oh my, I can't I cannot begin to talk about how you don't do that. Don't do that. You can tell George you scared him off for good. I'm just gonna go and eat out of this trash can instead. Notice how you don't see us walking away. We're here. Wait. I know what you were doing, Linus. If you need food, just ask. I don't want anyone in Pelican Town to go hungry. Gus is too nice. Like, he's not too nice. Like, this is the right thing to do. But, like, he's, he's just so nice. He's a very nice person. I got a basket of zucchini fritters for you. Just make sure you dip them in the spicy marinara. Go on, take it. Like, I... Personally, what you should do with food that is being wasted is you should uh, put it into a... You should compost it. That's To me, that makes perfect sense. I think composting, air quote, used food makes a lot of sense. And it's kind of a shame that we don't have systems set up to auto-compost. Like, where we can just send our food to be composted. Because uh, it's safer that way. Because, like, you put something in the trash, a fly gets on it, and something gets into it, uh, maybe some liquid goes through. Like, there's so many different things that can go wrong that just, no, don't do that. Don't, don't do it. I know a few people who do it, and, like, I, I've, uh, or have done it, and I understand that, like, not when you are, when you are starving, that is, like, that, that's like that's all you've got so like I get it but if you can help it do not it's very it's very dangerous you can get mega sick Gus is nice he is very nice almost a little bit too nice for his own good not in like a bad way but like with Pam he's like I don't I, he doesn't know what, what how to he, like he doesn't he doesn't want to be a jerk, but he needs money. He needs you to pay, right? So he's like, rrr, rrr, rrr. he goes back and forth with himself on it. Be nice to Gus. Okay, a packet has been delivered. We've leveled up.
And bowl. Oh, no, it's fish. We can do fish. Fish we can do. I always forget the fish one, but, uh... Somebody is rocking out. Outside. Outside. Parse. Ah! Well, wouldn't speak of the devil. And the devil will be summoned. Wait. Quality crops. Oh, quality crops. Quality. Okay. That's going to be a pain in the butt. But that's okay. And I know I could have this place torn down and just pay for it, and that would be easier. Believe me, I think that would be a lot easier. Getting large sums of money is not nearly as difficult as getting all of these things, so. But I don't want to. I'd rather Jojo Mart not. I hate authoritarianism, and Jojo Mart kind of reminds me of that. Pierre isn't too much better, but, like, he's just one guy, so it's not as bad. <laughs> you know? He's getting one guide. Somebody save him. We could do some night fishing. And she escaped. I could have phrased that better. She got away. <laughs> Maybe I couldn't have phrased that better. We didn't get to talk to her today. That's how, yeah, that's how we phrase it better. There we go. We did it. Do you think that the, the meter will be lit up? Like, will it, will it be under the darkness filter too, or do you think it'll be bright enough to see? We did it! Oh, it is bright. Okay, cool. We caught a bream! We need one of those, I think. Yeah, we do. We do need one of those, actually. I think there's a fish that you need to fish for when it's raining in here, and I think there's one... Isn't there another one that... I don't remember... The, the specifics for a lot of these fish are wild. It's everything from in a thunderstorm to, like, on these particular days... You can only catch this fish in the winter. That's my favorite. Squid. Katamari. Katamari. Um, no, I do not like seafood very much. Do you guys like seafood? I eat fish. Fish is fine. I mean, honestly, I take... I, I have... Uh, what is it? What is it called when they when people say they they take? Uh, it's not a fence. It's I, I take when they when they when they say they have a problem with something. They say I take I take up issue with the fact that uh, I don't know. I don't like eating. I don't like eating stuff. Isn't there one you can only catch in the summer? Almost assuredly, in the rain, in a thunderstorm, near a log. Oops, I wasn't paying attention. But I love fried fish. Fish is good. There's nothing wrong with fish. Um, can't do octopus. Nope, none of those things. Eel, uh-uh, none of it. Not interested in that. Don't like caviar? Nope, none of that. Not into it. It's over. It's overrated. It's kind of gross. Don't like it. Not interested. Look at that pro move. Look at that pro move we just pulled off. Look at that. Is this another bream or is this something different? Nope, it's a bream. We got a thing. Other. There's other. I, I don't mind seaweed. Seaweed is fine. I like seaweed, I think. I don't know if I could eat it on its own. 
but it's fine. It doesn't bother me in uh, sushi or anything. That was an interesting thing I talked to my parents. Who is this? This is Emily. I work part time at Gus's Inn. It pays the bills. Aww. Imagine being able to work part time and pay your bills. Isn't that lovely? Uh, what was I talking about? Seaweed. My parents, both of my parents, I think, have mentioned that they've tried um, sushi and they found it to be too salty. I don't understand that because I've not run into this issue. I haven't felt that any of my sushis I've ever had, regardless of what type of sushi they are, I don't think any of them have been salty. I'm passed out, but I'm inside, so it's okay. <laughs> 